Yo, 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 it's the Stashies Tutorials back, and today we have the Auto Tune Effect in Sony Vegas. Start your SoundCloud career, aka have it just to, I don't know, do Auto Tune Effect. Alright, quick tutorial, here we go. Boom. Step number one you want to go to this website. Once you're at this website, you're going to want to download one of these versions it's either the 64-bit version or the 32-bit version i'm gonna download 64-bit 32 bits kind of old so you probably have 64-bit now so click that oh wait you have this download here you're gonna want to open this download by clicking open and then boom this pops up all right so what we want to do is you want to go to your desktop you want to right click your desktop click new folder and call it G snap all right now what you want to do with this folder and this Renoir file you want to highlight these and drag them over to this new folder and then wait a little bit I'll click the folder see if it's in there all right it's in the folder the new folder okay here's where it starts to get complicated guys First things first, you want to have your Vegas closed. So if this is open, close it. Alright, so what you want to do next is go to your folder. You want to make your way to this PC, right? You want to click your drive that you have everything on. Click it. Now you want to go to Program Files x86, right? Click that. Okay, now if you have Vegas 14, you're going to want to click this Vegas folder. But if you have every, anything under Vegas 14, 13, 11, 12, blah, 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 you want to click this Sony folder. I'm going to use it on Vegas 14, so I'm going to click this Vegas folder. Click it. Now inside this folder, you have another folder called the Shared Plugins. You want to click that too. Now just imagine this isn't here. Okay, now you want to get the folder you have the files in, or, or okay, the folder on your desktop which the files are in. You want to grab it, you want to drag it inside the shared plugins folder and then once you do that um once you do that you got to move on to vegas so close this out and then open up your beloved sony vegas so to finish this off you're gonna need uh, you're gonna need to do one more step so you're gonna have to go up here to options click go to preferences go over to here to vst effects click that Okay, you won't have this here. You won't, if this is the first time doing it, you won't have anything here. Go to defaults VSD search folder. You want to click browse. And then you want to go down to program files, right? Program files 86. Go all the way to Vegas, which is the one I put it in. Right? Then shared plugins. And then the G snap folder, because that's where the auto tune is. All right, after you do that, you, you want to click like this, and then this will pop up, right? You want to click refresh. Yes. You're just going to want to wait a little bit because it's loading other stuff. Hold on one second. All right, so G-Snap will come up. You want to click G-Snap, and you want to click apply. Then you want to click OK. Boom, and then you have G-Snap. But wait, how do you use this G-Snap? Okay, so you're going to want to... Record something first, so let me record something. Hey, what up? Stashiest Tutorials here. This is a stashy tutorial. Alright. That's good enough. Alright, so now to add your effect, you want to click this little button here, or if you want to add it to the whole layer, uh, you want to click this button. I'm just going to add it to this single link. Uh, click this button and now what you want to do is you have all these folders here and all these effects right you want to go to VST effects this VST folder click it click G snap click add click OK and then this will pop up on your screen and that's basically it that's how you get this autotune plugin in Sony Vegas now how to use it uh, that's a whole nother tutorial for a whole nother time um, if you want to sound like T-Pain, uh, just click on the presets and click share the pain. And that's basically it. And then just mess around with the settings and you'll have whatever. If you want to start your SoundCloud career, um, just mess with the settings.
but yeah yeah all right and that's pretty much it for this video cool like subscribe just watch the video share it cool awesome peace out later